Hi folks, this is Jason. Hope you're okay today. It's good to see you. We're looking at our third part in our series on atheism and scholarship. The next person I want us to look at and think about is Richard Carrier. Richard Carrier's main argument against Christianity is a kind of biblical kind of historian. He's a historian come biblical kind of scholar. Um, he basically takes the argument that the life of Jesus is is kind of like mythological because the Jewish writers or the writers of of the life of Jesus actually got their ideas from the Old Testament and so the life of Jesus is just a myth from the Old Testament now this is just very very bad bad scholarship indeed we know that the writers of the New Testament use the Old Testament but in a different way than Carrier suggests he's saying that history was created from Old Testament stories and brought into New Testament times and it was made up history about Jesus. The problem with that is we know how the early church used the Old Testament. They used the Old Testament to teach us about Christ, his prophecies, the prophecies of him dying on the cross for example. So they, the New Testament used prophecies to confirm that who Jesus was. Typology for example, when Moses held up the staff uh, and the and the snakes were underneath, and um, you know it it was a, a sign that you would be protected if you believed in the cross of Christ from the sting of the serpent, Satan. Uh, when they sacrificed the lambs and the goats in the Old Testament, it was a symbol of Jesus Christ. So there was typology. Um, but there was definitely no creating of stories out of Old Testament stories about Jesus. And we know that because uh, E.P. Saunders has said, uh, an eminent uh, scholar, um, New Testament scholar, has said the basic outline of Jesus' life has been historically verified. And I could go on at length to tell you how we have sources outside the Bible, uh, sources inside the New Testament that confirm the historicity of Jesus Christ and I never get tired of telling you about the historicity of the Gospels by Dr. Balcom at Southern Baptist Theological Seminary those four lectures are seminal in showing you how the Gospels are historically reliable eyewitness accounts so in other words this Jewish mythology of Carrier lacks any real uh, sort of objective intellectual um, verification. This is not uh, a new idea, it was used by uh, Strauss um, in the 19th century and um, a very subjective way of doing biblical theology. So, that's Richard Carrier for you.